In the ever-evolving world of technology, Apple once again sets the bar high with a series of exciting announcements. The tech giant recently unveiled a supercharged iPad Mini, which is already making waves in the industry. This isn't just any iPad Mini, it's a giant leap forward likened to a large, glorified iPhone. This 8.3-inch device features a speaker system that emits sound from both sides in landscape mode, snazzy camera details, and a transition from lightning to USB-C port. Powered by the same chip as the iPhone 13 lineup, the iPad mini has a relocated home button and is compatible with the second-generation Apple Pencil. With a price tag of $499, this iPad mini isn't just a device, it's a statement. But Apple didn't stop there. They also announced the upcoming iPad OS 17 software update, set to release in a public beta in July and fully launched by the fall. This update boasts features like a health app, augmented reality effects in FaceTime, and dynamic PDF editing. However, while iPad OS 17 will be compatible with newer iPad models, some older models that support iPad OS 16 won't be able to download the new software. Let's not forget the iPhone 13 lineup, which, although overshadowed by the iPad mini's design updates, also received minor tweaks. These include a smaller notch, a larger battery, and an improved camera. In the realm of technology, Apple remains a juggernaut, continually innovating and pushing the envelope. With these latest announcements, Apple continues to redefine our expectations of what our devices can do. What was once the realm of science fiction is now the reality of our everyday lives. As we look forward to the future, one thing is clear. Apple continues to innovate and push the boundaries of what we can expect from our devices. These announcements are more than just updates, they signal a shift in Apple's approach to technology. The unveiling of the supercharged iPad mini, for instance, is not just about packing more power into a smaller device, it's about redefining what a tablet can do. This iPad mini, likened to a giant iPhone, shifts from lightning to the USB-C port bringing it into alignment with industry standards and signaling a broader shift in Apple's strategy. Now let's talk about compatibility. The iPad OS 17 software update, while a leap forward in functionality, unfortunately means some older iPad models will be left behind. This is a clear nudge from Apple encouraging users to upgrade their devices for the best user experience. And it's not just about hardware and software upgrades. Apple is also putting a strong emphasis on device security. The company underscored the importance of updating devices with the latest security patch to ward off potential threats. This highlights Apple's commitment to not just creating cutting-edge devices, but also ensuring the security of its user base. The spotlight on the new Pencil Pro and its compatibility with the iPad Mini further indicates Apple's push towards making professional-grade tools accessible to a wider audience. This, coupled with the new brighter screens and faster chips, suggests a focus on enhancing user experience and productivity. In essence, these announcements reflect Apple's evolving approach to technology, a move towards universal compatibility, a push for regular device updates, an emphasis on security, and a commitment to making professional tools more accessible. As technology advances, Apple is ensuring its users are not left behind. Apple's recent event was packed with important updates and announcements. The star of the show was the supercharged iPad Mini, likened to a giant iPhone. It's sporting a brighter screen, faster chips, and compatibility with the Pencil Pro. With a speaker system that emits sound from both sides in landscape mode, a snazzier camera, and a switch from lightning to USB-C port, the iPad Mini is a reflection of Apple's commitment to continuous innovation. The iPad Mini wasn't the only one getting a boost. The iPad OS 17 software update was announced, introducing features like a health app, augmented reality effects in FaceTime, and dynamic PDF editing. However, it's important to note that some older iPad models won't be compatible with this new software. So, be sure to check in your settings if your iPad is ready for the upgrade. The iPhone 13 lineup also saw minor changes, with a smaller notch and a larger battery. The Pro models offer improved battery life, better cameras, and a 120Hz adaptive refresh rate. And let's not forget about the Apple Watch Series 7, which now features a tougher display and faster charging, so what's the bottom line? This event was not just about flashy new features, it was a testament to Apple's dedication to enhancing the user experience, pushing the boundaries of technology, and setting new industry standards. Apple's event was a display of technological prowess, with updates that promised to enhance user experience and set new standards in the industry.